In today's video, I want to talk about a product called Fishmox. Fishmox is a product that's that was created for uh, aquariums and fish, and basically, it's amoxicillin um, that you put in your fish tank in order to uh, kill bacteria in inside your fish tank. And you know, if you have sick fish, you would use this to uh, help kill the infection and bacteria in your aquarium. There's a lot of different companies out there that sell fish mocks. Uh, you can get it on pretty much any uh, veterinarian medical uh, website that sells a lot of you know aquarium and fish and aquatic products. Um, and a lot of people say that um, uh, having fish mocks or amoxicillin uh, in this form is a good backup plan to have in the event of a WROL or SHTF situation. Okay, so um, when I decided to buy some fish mocks, um, I decided to go on eBay and check out on there and see what the prices were. I looked all over the internet, and, and the prices kind of varied from one, uh, you know, from really high to, um, you know, a reasonable price. Um, on eBay, it's called aquatic amoxicillin, um, and you can get it in many different forms. Um, for example, um, if you look on here, you can see that they have um, 250 milligrams of 50 count is 1049, and that's with uh, free shipping. A um, hundred count is 16.99 with free shipping. 500 milligram 50 count, 14 dollars free shipping. So it kind of varies in price, and you know you be the judge of of you know which particular count you want to get. This 500 milligrams, a hundred count. Is $24.99 with free shipping. Um, so that's not too bad. 25 bucks for 100 500 milligram amoxicillin. Uh, amoxicillin is an antibiotic. It's uh, used to kill bacteria and infection. So if you you know had bronchitis or an upper respiratory tract infection or a urinary tract infection or something like that, uh, this would be a good drug for that. This particular uh, dealer on uh, eBay is Aquatic Pharmacy. Uh, they do sell a lot of other products besides um, amoxicillin. Um, for example, they have tetracycline, they have doxycycline, te um, amoxicillin, ampicillin, ciprofloxin, uh, penicillin, and a lot of other stuff on here that you could go and check out for yourself. Um, but right now we're just looking at amoxicillin um, for this particular video. Now I'll kind of walk you through what I did and how I sort of researched the purchase of this. Okay, so here's their advertisement. Uh, it's free shipping, $24.99 for 500 milligrams, 100 count of amoxicillin. Uh, here they show... In their picture, you can see um, they show the bottle, and I can attest that this is the bottle because I ordered this, and that's what it says. It says aquatic amoxicillin, 500 milligrams, 100 count capsules, USP. Now, USP stands for United States Pharmacopoeia, and if you want to read about them, you can go to www.usp.org, and they will explain that they are a non-governmental public standards setting authority for prescription and over-the-counter medications that are sold in the United States. Uh, so if you want to read about those standards or uh, anything about USP, just visit USP.org and you can pretty much uh, check out whatever you want. Another reason that I ordered from this particular company is because they show you what the pill looks like. Um, this was very helpful. It has a code written on the pill, WC731. Um, and that was very helpful because you can go to a website called drugs.com and you can type in amoxicillin at, in the pill identifier section, which is up here. There's a link that says pill identifier, and it pops up and says, um, for amoxicillin, it should be pink and red, and it should say WC731 on the pill, and it does say that. So this tells me that this is a 500 milligram 
uh, pink and red capsule shape amoxicillin, uh, which is exactly the same as uh, this one. So I would think uh, you could rest, be rest assured that uh, this is pretty much the same amoxicillin that you would buy uh, a, you know, in your human pharmacy, um, but you'd probably pay a lot more money for it than on here, which, you know, like I said, a hundred, a hundred of these 500 milligrams is $25 with free shipping. So, uh, that's really a heck of a deal compared to, you know, if you went and bought a hundred of these in your pharmacy with your, assuming you even had insurance, it would probably be, uh, close to a hundred bucks for a 30 day supply, maybe. So, if you're looking for any of these uh, medications, um, like I said, they have amoxicillin, they have tetracycline, um, doxycycline, uh, cipro, floxin, uh, and all of these show what the pills look like, so you can go and verify on drugs.com that this is the exact pill uh, made by the manufacturer for human consumption. And, and have a pretty good amount of confidence that that's what you're getting. So these would be really good um, backup plans. Um, I'm not suggesting that um, today if you had a kidney infection or a kidney stone or something that you should go on eBay and buy some amoxicillin uh, for that. You should definitely go to the doctor. But if you were in a situation, an emergency or a disaster had occurred or um, we're in a WROL situation or SHTF or something to that category, uh, this would definitely be a, a good thing to have as a backup. Not only that, but you could definitely use um, something like this as a barter item. Uh, if you had a hundred, um, if you had a bottle of a hundred of these, 500 milligrams, you could put them in little baggies of, you know, 10 in each bag and, um, you know, use them as a barter tool. You know, I'll give you 10 of these infection killers for you know, whatever you need, water, food, etc. Thanks for watching Smart Survival. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.